this is therapeutic. Happy New Year! What's going on, you guys? For y'all that don't know, I'm for y'all that do know, my name is Ashley, and I'm back with another video. So, hi, it's been a long time. It's been a very, very long time. Um, and I am, I have a lot of updates, but I am actually on my way to a doctor's appointment. And um, yeah, so that's fun. Today is, we're, I'm vlogging, obviously. And um, I don't know how long this, uh, this is just gonna be a day in the life of a nine month pregnant lady. I don't know, cause you know something new. Um, yeah, so if y'all have not known, if y'all do not follow me on my socials, um, Instagram and Facebook, I am pregnant. It's, yeah, I haven't been on TikTok lately. Instagram and Facebook. If y'all don't follow me there, you probably don't know. But I am pregnant. Yes, I'm pregnant. Pregnant. Get my child support and pay my rent. Pay my rent. Your opinion is irrelevant. Irrelevant because I'm a baby mama. I can do just what I want to turn up. Um, I want to do that dance. But anyway, yeah. So I'm pregnant. I am nine months pregnant. I am almost done. I'm 38 weeks and one day or two days i don't know how they count that i was i know i was 38 weeks yesterday so i don't know if that's 38 weeks in zero days or 38 weeks in one day but i'm 38 weeks and um excuse me sir Ugh. i hate driving out here these people make me sick it's so aggravating anyway um I am on my way to my doctor's appointment and um, I'm tired. I already did stuff today, like crazy, already did stuff. I mean, it's it's 10.28. My car clock says 10.28, so it's probably 10.29, 10.30. But it's 10.28 and um, I have already done things today and I'm excited about that because look at me getting up and doing stuff. So, um, we did have a, de a delay of, like um, my, my son, his school was delayed today because we had a storm yesterday and child, that storm was, it was, that storm was storming all day. Like from, from the time we woke up to the time we went to sleep, it was storming all day. Um, so we had a delay, like he didn't even go to school yesterday. I'm like, is is? So I texted my husband. I was like, is this? Is the rain enough for him to not go to school? And he was like, yeah, it's supposed to be bad. I was like, all right, bad. He ain't going. We ain't even gonna do it. So he was at home yesterday. Um, the school. I mean, well, that's irrelevant. But it was a delay of um, delay today. So it was a slow morning at home for everybody. And it was like, it was a vibe. It was like chill. It was like a Saturday morning. But like without the super crazy responsibility, because Saturdays for us are rough because, oh, not rough, but are a lot because of sports. So um, it was like a Saturday. It was like it was like a Saturday without the the hecticness, and like a Sunday without the laziness. So it was a it was a good little morning. So I went to um, a store. It's called Mom. It's called Mom to Mom. And it's like a consignment shop for um, moms and babies and kids and stuff. So maternity clothes, kids clothes, kids toys, kids shoes, um, baby gear, toddler gear, meaning bassinets, strollers, um, cribs, bouncers, swings. They have literally everything. So like the popular ones, so I live in Virginia. The popular secondhand stores like that um, are Once Upon a Child and Kid to Kid. So the store that I went to today is not, I, I do not believe it's a franchise. I think it's a mom and pop shop. Mom and pop shop. And um, it was a vibe. Like they had so much stuff in there. And I found um, my baby's, what is it? Going home, 
like home from the hospital outfit because that's easy and it's just a, it's just a, a onesie just a pajama set just a what is it a sleeper a pajama sleeper thing it was just one of those um and it was so cute like the colors are cute and i don't we don't know what this baby is i don't know if it's a boy or a girl like i don't know for sure if it's a boy or a girl i am almost positive um well i don't want to i don't even want to tell you what i'm almost positive it is but my 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 people know what i want it to be and they be watching my videos so they, they know what i'm trying to say but anyway um the 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 sleeper that i got is gender neutral it's like orange and like a sage green or something like that and gray or something it was pretty and i was like wow like it was it was it was pretty but it was it was still gender neutral it was cute um ugh, excuse me i'm so tired and I, I have like i just ate some grapes so now i'm burping because i'm so big it's like my stomach has this much room for stuff Ugh, and it's uncomfortable it's like it would have been heartburn if it was like something tomato based but since it was grapes it's not um what was I saying? I forgot. What was I talking about? The onesie. I was talking about the onesie. Oh my God. Pregnancy brain, y'all. This is too. <laughs> Pregnancy brain. But the onesie. Yeah. So, um, gender neutral. Super cute. I'm going to take that to the hospital. I'm not bringing a whole bunch of stuff to the hospital for the baby because my hospital, my hospital is top tier. So, they're gonna give me stuff for the baby I don't have to take anything <laughs> for the baby um, I'm so excited about that but I do have to you know you, you do have to have an outfit to bring the baby home in um, so I'll have that and then like a t-shirt onesie because with babies they always need an extra layer um, like whatever you would normally wear like if you're wearing one layer like a you know like a sweatshirt and then like a jacket they need the onesie whatever they're wearing and then like a blanket like they need one more layer than what you're wearing um so i'm gonna bring like a, a short sleeve onesie and then the the sleeper and i'm bringing them home in that like that's gonna be cute and exciting um but yeah, I found two of those, and that store, Mom to Mom, they have a sale going on today, so all their clothes is 50% off. Um, I found my son some jeans because he needs jeans, and I was like, oh, this is your size. Let's get this. And the store associate was like, oh, yeah, everything, all the clothes are 50% off. I said, oh, for sure. Let's see if we can find anything else real quick. And we went like right before I had to drop him off to school. So I couldn't like be really, really shopping in there. Um, but like for his size, those were the only jeans I could find anyway. So I got what I could. I got the baby thing, but I will be going back um, probably after my appointment because it was my first time in there today. I'm sorry about the glare, you know, I'm driving. Um, it was my first time in there today but it was dope like it was really fire so and like they had the like it used to be like a house so all of the different um sizing and things like that were um like separated in the different rooms and oh i also got i did not see that car i also got so the, re the original reason i went there was to get a breast pump because um they get breast pump donations because i think you're not supposed to sell those secondhand or something like that i don't know what the the regulation is you probably could sell them but they get bre breast pumps donated so if something is donated like just donated not like consigned they usually don't sell it from my understanding or they sell breast pump things i mean or they give the breast pump things away because they're so expensive so it's like a like a blessing type thing um so yeah so i went there for a breast pump because last night on facebook they had posted that they had all these breast pumps and i had been having a hard time getting one like through my insurance because my insurance is trash um and i need to get better insurance and i will i will open enrollment I'm, I'm switching because but anyway 
Um, yeah, so I had been having trouble getting it, but I finally got that situated the other day. But I saw the post last night, and I was like, and I saw that they had a portable one. They had a portable press, breast pump. And I was like, yo, let me hop on that. What time y'all open? <laughs> um, and they said that, I didn't say it like that, but they said they opened at 9. So I was like, all right, let me just, let me go in there and see what they have. And so I grabbed the portable one and the portable one is the same brand as the one that I, the, as the one that I'm ordering brand new through my insurance. I was like, okay, cool. So I can like the, the pieces will be compatible um, because I'm not using the ones that came with the portable pump. Like I'm not like the pump itself I'll use, but I'm not using the pieces that somebody else used. Like I'm, I'm not doing that. Um, so that is where we're at with it. I got the, um, I got their clothes. I got the breast pump, which is what I went for. Um, and I spent $7. I spent $7 at that store on two sleepers, a pair of boys jeans. Cause he is not no little boy. A regular boys jeans and a breast pump I walked out of there spending seven dollars like you cannot tell me nothing it was crazy I was so excited um, so now I am I'm pulling into the I pulled into the parking garage and I'm looking for parking uh, what's today Wednesday These people make me tired. No, no, goddamn. Oh no, I found a parking spot. I was about to cur I was about to curse it out. Why would they be parked over the line like that? Damn. Shit. All right. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. So now I gotta back into a spot because I ain't finna rush it with these people. But I do have to, um, I am almost late for my appointment, which is not fun, but that's my fault because I should have left earlier. <laughs> Definitely my own fault. I should have left like five minutes earlier. Um, why is everybody crooked? What the fuck? Sir, you could have got damn with it. You're driving all up in front of me. But anyway, um, yeah, so I'm getting ready to walk in now. Um, and I will see you all probably when I'm done. Because I can't. I can't vlog in there. I mean, I probably could. I could show y'all the room or whatever, but yeah. All right, well, I'll see y'all in a little bit. All right, so I'm leaving my appointment now. It was quick, um, but we're almost there. <sighs> So, ew. Just had some water drop on me. But, um, yeah, so she basically said that, well, I'm not gonna tell y'all. That ain't, that ain't y'all business. I'm about to tell you. That just, anyway, I am, I don't know what I'm about to do right now. There's a couple of things that I need to do. Um, ooh, no, I'm gonna hit these people's car. I need to get some raspberry leaf tea. I need to do a whole bunch of that. All right, so I'm sorry about the lighting in here, but I, like I said, I, I was I parked in the parking deck, um, but and I had to figure out where I'm going next um, before I leave, really. So, but before I do that, 
I, so I was just on, on Facebook because Facebook be making me laugh, like, for real, for real. So, I made a friend on Facebook. Uh, she lives in my area. We just haven't been able to, like, get up yet. And we're really, really similar people. Um, and, like, I saw, <laughs> I saw a post that said not having kids is a flex and don't let nobody tell you that it's not right now mind you i have a son and i'm about to have a baby but i ain't even gonna hold you not having kids is a flex i don't care what nobody say if you do not have kids live your life and run it up in every way that you can it absolutely is a flex like, don't let these parents be like, not having kids is not a flex. It, it's not this. It's not It's not all that. Like, we're grown. You can have kids and still do it. Like, yeah, you can be, like, we grown. You can have kids. You can still have a life. But, damn it, it'd be a lot easier if I ain't have none. Life would be a lot different if I ain't had no kids. <laughs> Oh my gosh, y'all shared it. I ain't even put no little razzle dazzle on it. I just shared like the original post. And um the friend that I made that I was that I was telling you about, she commented on it and was like, no, really. And you know, with the, the skull faces. And I'm like, bro, like imagine, imagine the life we'd be living if we ain't had no kids. Shorty said, I'd be in Italy with my laptop because work from home means work from internet connection like it doesn't it doesn't matter where i am i'm like shoot i'd, I'd have a villa in jamaica i would literally i would be a dual citizen <laughs> oh my goodness if i ain't had no kids but um shoot i wouldn't even be living where i'm living now if i ain't had no dog or kids man like it's just lord but it um i just thought that that was funny and i wanted to share but i need to figure out i need to figure out where i'm going um i need to go to target <sighs> i need to go to target and get um i want to so the the raspberry tea i have is a raspberry herbal tea but it's not raspberry leaf tea even though there are raspberry leaves in it i need raspberry leaf tea and right now, well, I actually, I guess I don't have to do that right now. Like, I can order a, a pickup order from Target. But I do want to go back to mom to mom and, like, see what they have and rack up, like, where I can. Um, but, I, like, I kind of want to go to Target to look at their dollar spot stuff because Valentine's Day is coming up and um their dollar spot stuff has been like on fire like i i i follow like a couple of target influencer type accounts on instagram and i like i've just been like they have tea party valentine's day themed stuff and i think it's the cutest it sucks for me because i don't have a daughter i don't know if this baby is gonna be a girl but even if it is a girl it ain't like she could do a tea party you know like in a month like so um and jordan my my son ain't trying to do no, he ain't trying to do no tea party with me not no not no pink cup see they ain't trying to do that with me my husband ain't trying to do no tea party like he he don't even man so and my friends live far away they live far away so like and then i and then i'm gonna have a new like i'm gonna be barely three four weeks postpartum so like i think i kind of want to just go to target and look at them because it doesn't make sense for me to buy them if i'm not going to use them boo tomatoes tomatoes um so okay so i think i'm going to go to mom to mom um am i hungry i think i'm hungry maybe i want a snack it's almost lunchtime it's 11 20 now I don't know. 
it's still early uh, this is all this is seems like a lot of content for it to be so early but um i don't know how much i'm actually going to be vlogging today so we'll see i don't know and i'm not going to be driving talking to you guys again because that was distracting and just making a video is not worth getting in an accident i'm not doing that hell no um <laughs> lord jesus grant me traveling mercies please um yeah i think i'm gonna go to mom to mom and i'll probably show you guys like the inside of that store or whatever and um and then go home because there is a lot that i need and want to do oh i gotta go to Lidl. i gotta go um to the grocery store that i go to because they have a sale on the um the all free and clear laundry detergent which is the laundry detergent that um i'm going to switch my family to um and it's like the big the really really big gallon like the i think it's a gallon but the big gallon detergent uh, i'm going to switch to that that way i don't have to buy 50 million like not 50 million but i don't have to buy like a separate detergent for the baby because all free and clear i used for my son when he was a baby because um our pediatrician was like, yeah, as long as it's free and clear, it's fine. Like, it doesn't have to be, like, dreft. Dreft is what people normally use for, um, for our baby clothes and baby stuff. But, like, if I'm using, um, gain and that's not what the baby is used to, then my clothes can irritate the baby. So, I'd rather just wash all of our clothes in the same stuff so that the baby can get used to it. And I just won't switch until, like, they're old enough. So, um... The only thing about the free and clear is like the smell you there isn't one <laughs> so I, ha I am gonna get the um the scented booster things um and i think we're running out of those so i gotta get some more of those and we just won't use those for like the baby stuff like it'll be fine so yeah so i have to go there i'll go i will go there first no i'll go there second I don't know. Let's just I'll go to whatever's closer first and I and I'll I'll just show you guys. You'll see. I don't know, but I'll be back probably when I'm at home. But I have missed you guys and I hope that you guys have missed me because this is therapeutic. So I'll see y'all in a little bit. Y'all, so I was in mom to mom for like an like an hour, hour and a half like a really long time i don't know how long it was and i forgot to record the downstairs with all of the different rooms and stuff but this is upstairs in the clearance section and this day it happened to be everything was 50 percent off so all this stuff is usually 99 cents and it was 50 cents so i was going through like everything to see what i could find but like look at these little itty bitty baby clothes like i could not take it because i haven't seen them so small in so long um and i was just so excited so I also came across this um, Kindred Bravely, I think it's called, um, this maternity, lab yeah, Bravely, um, this labor and delivery gown. And I was so excited because this brand is really expensive, but I got it for $15. I also found this VCU Health onesie, and you know, I went to VCU, and this is the rest of the stuff that I got. Okay, y'all, so I done made it back home, and today has been a day. Like, I showed y'all a little bit of me getting some stuff from um, mom to mom and then I ended up having to go to god this is not even warm yet I ended up having to go to um where did I go I went to family dollar no so I went to the, the grocery store um I was gonna go to the grocery store because I needed to get um laundry detergent that's what i was going for because when i went the other day the laundry detergent that i wanted was on sale for ten dollars for like the big gallon excuse me and um i went there it was not on sale anymore today is wednesday their sales change on wednesday and i didn't realize it and i was like god damn because those big things of um of detergent is really 17 dollars like what and i usually get mine from family dollar and i get the family dollar version because it's cheaper like i get the family dollar brand of gain um 
and we usually use that and it's not even 12 I think it's like 11 50 or something like that um so I was gonna get the all free and clear for 10 bucks from the grocery store not on sale anymore so I said I'm not paying for it because Target has one that's similar um that's just the Target brand for 11.65 or something like that um so I was like all right I'm just not gonna get it right now I'm gonna get the little things that I need to get up out of here and then I'm going home because I have to do a pickup order from Target and I was tired and I had been out all day and I'm very 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 pregnant and very tired so I came home um and I was hungry I did not eat lunch today I had breakfast um I had my dates I had my raspberry tea and I just been on the move I'm tired so I came home so I could eat and now I'm not even gonna hold you I don't think I'm doing anything for the rest of the day I made um I had some rotisserie chicken in the fridge so I made me a sandwich um because I like that and now I'm about to eat some enchiladas that were frozen some frozen enchiladas because I don't care that's fine and give me some enchiladas and then that's it i'm tired i'm not doing nothing else for the rest of the day it's oh it's four o'clock it's four o'clock my day is done <laughs> and that's really how it be like i'm about to sit on my couch watch youtube um to i've watched so many youtube videos on like how to prepare for a baby as if i don't have a child um, but like, you know, just seeing new things that's out there, seeing what people are packing for their hospital bags and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, so, oh, and I showed you guys a little bit of what I found, um, when I went to mom to mom, that was like the biggest thing for me. Um, but I got, uh, a mirror, the baby mirror. I got, um, a mattress pad. I got my labor and delivery robe from Kindred, which is expensive, and it was not expensive there. And um, the rest of everything I got was just baby clothes. Now, they did have a clearance section. All their clearance stuff is normally a dollar, and today everything was 50% off in the store. So their clearance stuff was 50 cent all of the clearance stuff i got came up to like seven dollars and 50 cent i got almost 20 things what is that what does that matter i think that's 15 things that i got and that stuff was only 750 um and then like the regular priced items or like the regular stuff the stuff that's not on clearance all that stuff was 50 percent off too um and i just i spent 60 dollars in that store and i got so much stuff like getting three sets like three sleeper sets or three like outfits at any store like a target or carter's or um any like baby clothes store you would spend 60 dollars on three three hangers of clothes and i got so much clothes and other stuff for 60 bucks and a labor and delivery gown like Oh, I'm so grateful I found that place. I'm so happy about that. Um, and now, actually, it's four o'clock. I might, I might pack my hospital bag today. I might do that. Um, I don't. Th I'm not gonna vlog that because that uh, that'll be. Um, I can make that a video. What's in my hospital bag? Um, but yeah, I think I will. I think I'll pack my hospital bag tonight because now I have my labor and delivery gown and I can like just wash all the stuff that I need and put it away. And it'll only be out of like my regular rotation for like two weeks, as opposed to if I had done it two weeks ago, it would have been out of rotation for a month. So I'll do that tonight. Um, yeah, and then I'm doing what's in my hospital bag video. And oh, and I got the... Um, shoot that's why i wanted to get the detergent so that i could pack the bag and i could bring i could put the baby's um hospital like the going home outfit in my hospital bag too because i found one i found like an actual one at at mom to mom so and that was that one's only like three dollars 
as opposed to 15, 20, 25 from anywhere else. So it's fine. I'll do it. But I will see you all in the next vlog. I missed you guys so much. I hope you guys miss me too. Um, I haven't posted a video in a really long time and the videos that I do a while right now are still my texturizer videos. So if you want to see those, I will make some more of those. I, I, don't, I don't, don't think I'm texturizing my hair anymore, but I will do more hair videos and um, we'll see how it goes. So I will catch you all in the next one. Um, I'm not going to say weekly yet, but that's the goal. But I'll see y'all in the next video. Happy New Year. Bye. This is what the enchiladas look like if you were interested. But yeah.